Hi, it's Alaska Granny. Today I'm going to show you how you can hang a picture or a painting from the picture or crown molding in your home. So you need three items. You need a, a picture wire with D rings in it that fastens to the back of your painting. Then you need some molding hooks that hang over the hook or the, mold, the picture molding and then the wire will hook on to that is how you will hang your painting. Then you will take some extra braided wire or fishing line if you'd rather and hook that over your hook and fasten it to the back of your painting. Then you need two tools. You need some wire like pliers with a wire cutter and if you don't have that on your pliers you can always just have regular wire cutters because scissors sometimes won't cut wire. Step one, measure down equally on either side, about in the, somewhere in the top third of your painting, and put a little mark on either side, and then you're going to take the little D-ring, and you're going to screw it in, one on either side. Once you have those twisted all the way in, you want to take your wire and insert it into the uh, D-ring and you want to leave several inches of it extra so that you can twist it together. Then you're going to come to the other side and do the same. And you don't want to pull it tight, you want to leave a little slack in it so when you hang it, it has a little play to help it stay on the hook. Now I'm going to take the other side and put it through the D-ring and pull it through, making sure I leave a little slack. Try to keep the kinks out of it. And I'm leaving a little slack and then I'm going to cut off the excess. I'm leaving several inches to twist and cutting off the excess wire. Now I'm going to Hold this a little loosely and twist this around, making sure that it will hold it tightly because it's twisted many times. Okay, I've finished wrapping both ends. Now I'm going to take my picture hanger and I'm going to hook the large end over the picture molding and then the wire that's going to hold this wire is going to hook over the hook. So if you were able to put a nail in the wall where you live, you could just hang it on this. Or if you wanted, you could run one length of wire up to the picture molding hook. But because we live in earthquake country, we're going to use the wire from this D-ring up to the hook and then over to this D-ring. So we may not necessarily be using this wire today, but we still could use it any other time or application where we wanted to hang the picture. I finished twisting this side together. Now I'm going to extend this wire over the picture molding and then I'm going, or the hook at the picture molding, and then I'm going to put it through this side and then I can pull it up and down and secure it where I want the picture. This, if you haven't level, that would be a good time to use it, see if your picture is level. But your mind's eye is pretty good, so if you don't have a level, don't worry about it. I decided I have it where I want it, so I twisted it around. I'm going to snip off the extra wire and finish wrapping it around. If it's way too high for you, either get a tall friend or a ladder. Okay, I think it looks level, but I actually have a level, so I'm going to check it. And I think that's pretty good. So you can see it's not that difficult to hang a picture using the hook that goes on picture molding if you can't or don't want to put a hole in your wall. So leave me a comment or a message on how you hang pictures in difficult situations. And if you'd like to continue to receive tips and tricks from Alaska Granny, please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel. Have a wonderful day.